Once completed, the next step is to start fully adhering the sheets of IB membrane. Simply cut to fit and loosely lay the first row of IB membrane, making sure the sheet lays exactly where it needs to be. Keep in mind the 1 to 2 inch membrane overhang needed on any perimeter edges that will be receiving IB clad metal edging, such as drip edge or gravel stock. Also remember to always cut and or terminate the membrane at any and all turn up details, such as skylight and HVAC curves, chimneys, parapet walls, etc. Once completed, it is now ready to start applying adhesive. First, use an ink marker, a construction crayon, or a similar tool to score the dens deck at the top edge of the membrane sheet. This simply prevents the path of glue from being too narrow and parts of the membrane sheet not being fully adhered. If the path is too wide, it will result in a waste of adhesive. Now it's as simple as folding back half of the row of membrane and with a paint roller and handle, apply the IB water-based adhesive to the substrate and the substrate only. Be careful to keep all adhesive off the seams. Coverage should be even with no thick spots or puddles. Make sure that all sections of substrate within the pre-marked boundaries are covered. Immediately after applying adhesive to the chosen section of substrate, the membrane sheet must be moved back into place. It is very important that the membrane sheets are always set in wet adhesive. Unlike a contact adhesive, IB water-based adhesive does not require time to tack up before setting sheets in place. After the chosen row is completed with adhesive, applied to the substrate only, and the membrane sheets are set back in the wet adhesive, simply broom out any air pockets by pushing firmly over the top of the sheets with a clean shop push broom. This will also help set the sheet firmly into the adhesive. These simple and easy procedures will be repeated until all membrane rows have been fully adhered. Field seam overlaps on a fully adhered project only need to be two inches. This is because the field sheets will not require any fastener and plate attachment. However, it is typical to overlap the seams by five inches as to not show the factory salvaged edge line. Remember these simple steps. Cut fit sheets and loosely lay in exact place. Make adhesive path marks at the top of the membrane rows. Fold half of the membrane back to expose the substrate. Apply the IB water-based adhesive evenly to the substrate, keeping adhesive off the overlap seams. Then immediately set the membrane back into place and broom out any air pockets. By applying odorless IB water-based adhesive to the substrate only, as well as not having to waste valuable time for glued sheets to flash before being set, to say it's user-friendly would be an understatement.